Origin Pro has several built-in options for creating graphs from data containing categorical and numeric columns. These are organized in two categories in the plot menu, statistical and categorical. For the first example, I'll select the grouped violin plot for our data. In the dialog, I can assign the numeric column to the data input control. Then, for group columns, I can select multiple categorical columns. I can also rearrange the order of the groups and the preview will update to show the group order in the table below the plot. You can resize the layer, such as making it wider, and then make the page fit to the new layer dimension. Now let's look at another statistical graph example. In this worksheet, I have response data from two different drugs with three different protocols. I want to create a plot that compares the mean response for each subgroup. Let's use the Stats Advisor to find out what is the appropriate tool to use. The advisor asks a series of questions. I want to compare means, my data are assumed to be normally distributed, and I have two group variables, drug and protocol, and my data does not have repeated measures. The advisor suggests that I use the two-way ANOVA tool or the Paired Comparison Plot app. The app is free to download and install. I have already installed it here, so I will go ahead and open it. First, I'll assign the data column and select Drug and Protocol as the group columns. The app has choices for plot type. I'll select Bar. For significance marking on the plot, let's select asterisk with bracket. There are options for means comparison method. Let's select Tukey. The plot is created and you can clearly see the means across various subgroups. The asterisk bracket on top shows the significance marks based on p-values. Now let's reopen the dialog to change the plot. I'll select box chart this time and change the significance mark to p-values with bracket. The plot is now updated with the changes.